place was uh, was jumping tonight. I'm proud of my proud of my team. Um, this has been the toughest stretch that Rutgers basketball has ever played. You know, Jerry would be able to correct me on that. Of ranked teams and quality teams, and you know, come away with a win here today on Senior Night. I'm so happy and thankful for my seniors, the senior managers, um, Joey. Quasi and Shaq, you know, really appreciate our guys playing great for those guys tonight. We shared the game, 17 assists. I like everyone chipped in that came. We played, you know, an elite team. I mean, Maryland's elite. You guys saw that. I mean, Cowan's is like unguardable. Um, Sticks is, is a problem when they got good players. Morrell, all up and across the board, they're, they're worthy of their ranking for sure. And they were in first place in the league coming into tonight. So, um, you know, always congratulate Maryland. I watched all the tapes. I mean, he does a great job coaching them, and they're really good. So, uh, great win for us tonight. Real, real happy. Happy for the community. Happy for our students, season ticket holders. But more importantly, happy for our guys. Steve, what was the biggest key behind your team's response tonight? You know, I thought you know the extra days of prep was huge. I thought they were ready to play. Um, we had a you know good game plan, but their energy was great. They shared the game, and you know our defense was elite from the start. Um, so. You have to do a lot of things really well. I thought our offense was good, you know, to beat a, a team like that. So I thought we got contributions from everybody. Our bench, you know, JY comes off the bench, gives us a huge lift too in the first half. And, uh, as did Paul, and as did everybody that came off the bench, uh, Miles, <coughs> Caleb, the whole thing. So great team win. Coach, you know, I've seen a lot of these South Joe wins for from senior from senior days. It'll go 50 50. But with the added pressure of what you expect in this season, talk about getting the mind right for this team. As well. You know, I just love our team. You know, like just play. Like I just want them to play. You know, there's a lot of noise going on around. You know, outside. Uh, you know, social media, all this stuff that you know really doesn't matter. I just wanted them to play. You know, we're a good basketball team. We, we stick with our cores and do what we do. You know, we're good. And I thought they were locked in. We had our best practice of the season by far yesterday. I mean, they were locked in and ready to play, and they have been, you know, since we got back from the Penn State game. So, you know, real, really happy about our prep, and, and uh, they just played. They just played. They stopped worrying about all that stuff. Steve, Mark, Mark mentioned that he thought you guys looked looser and just more confident um, than they were. What did, did you do anything different, given all the noise and the Yeah, the just, season? you know, just try to get these guys. I mean, you know, it's been from the beginning of the year. Everyone talks about the end of the year. It's just, you know, like play one game at a time and just play. They were, they were ready to play today. It was nice to be at home and great for a crowd. I know senior day they were going to bring in a little bit extra, and they had to. I mean, this team was really good. They won 12, 10 out of the last 12 games. You know, they've only had two losses, and uh, they were close games, too. One where Colin fouled out, you know, at the end, last five minutes. So this is an elite team that we played. I thought, you know, guys just played, and Gio, uh, you know, led us. But all these guys, you know, up until the end, when Quasi shot that bomb. Gave <laughs> 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 me a heart attack on senior night. Um, you know, we, we were really good. We were really good. So. <laughs> Steve, do you think this is a game that kind of puts you over the hump because there were questions after February? And yeah, we don't really know. Just trying to win the next game. You know, the hump and all that. And you guys talk about that. It's good fun for you guys. We're trying to, you know, go to Purdue. When we've won a lot of games in the best league in the country, and you know we've had the number one schedule in the country, not just in the league, the last seven, eight games. So, like you know, we've won against a lot of really good teams. This is another one today, and we've got one more left with Purdue, and then the conference tournament. So we'll just try to remain locked in on that and let everyone else talk about it. Steve, what do you, what do you want to say about uh, what your home crowd did for you this season, finishing 18? Uh, I mean, I just I love, I love the students first of all. Like, Appreciate those guys a ton. The Riot Squad, they were the best band, the cheerleaders, they were awesome. But our season ticket holders were great too. And the community came out. And I mean, up until you know, 20 minutes before the game, we're still getting people, can I get in? Can I get in? You know, like, can I get in? People were asking you that? For a long time. Yeah, I mean, I was getting Texas all day yesterday, today. You know, like, it's just been unbelievable, you know. And uh, it's credit to these guys, though. They play the hard and they play together. And, and they're you know good students and students like them a lot so you know just very thankful for the home court advantage every team in our league has it so uh, you know it's nice now that you know we're in the same same place as everybody else if we talk about uh, the defense of uh, Marquette coming in on um, Cowan and DJ you know coming in pushing the ball um, Cowan was coming up oh. short 
So we got the game plan coming in. He's going to get the biggest graduation present from me. He's coming. It's been four years of, I mean, and if you read, you know, uh, their game notes, he's every category. In Maryland basketball is a ton of tradition, as you guys know. I mean, he's a elite player. Um, and we talked about it a great deal. And these guys took up the challenge. Like, he's a hard guy to guard. He shoots foul shots at an elite level. He makes threes. He's fast. Real hard guy, guy, but you know, thought these guys really were locked into the game plan. They did a good job. He didn't get anything easy. He got a couple of drives to the basket. We didn't rotate at the right time, but you know, he's really good, as, as you could see. And um, you know, we were just able to, you know, get a couple more on him. And then uh, I think the added bodies and the different looks, you know, kind of helps you. But, Any more questions for Coach? Did the sting from the three-game losing streak, your first three-game losing streak of the season, help push you to have your best practice of the season earlier this week? I mean, we've had really good practices throughout. I mean, this league is tough. You want streaks. This team has bounced back and, you know, been really good. Um, you know, they were focused tonight. I don't know if it has anything to do with when I mean, you play in this league, you want winning streaks and losing streaks. I think how many teams are ranked now? Eight teams are ranked? Eleven have been. I mean, like, you know, all just, uh, it's, it's, it was a gauntlet of a stretch. It was a stretch I knew we would have ups and downs in, you know, like, but, uh, you know, it's just glad they, they were locked in and, and, and they were ready to play. And, and that's a good thing. But those other games, they were ready to play, too. I mean, we're playing at Penn State. We're down 21. We come back to Lincoln. You know, like, you got to play real hard to do those kind of things. So proud of our guys. Stay the course. Keep plugging away. I want to know. You guys don't want to hear that, but that's you know, what it is. And that's what we got to remain, you know, humble, appreciative, and thankful. These guys have done that all. I appreciate it. Thank you guys.